Hello friends, welcome to welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, obviously it's a book haul, kind of mainly done my haul. Let's get into it because this is all I collected, I think this month alone, <laughs> in July. Um, yeah, let's just get into it because this is quite a lot. <laughs> okay, we're gonna test my look and see if this thing falls over or not today. It's pretty hot <laughs> here in Texas right now, so I'm sorry if I'm like sweating. As always, I'm going to say where I got them from in order. I think I want to split it up by like Bonmei and Manga because I do have quite differentiates of such. So I kind of want to do the Donmei first, question mark. There is a train. I'm so sorry. Um, I don't know. I kind of want to do the Manga first just because I don't have too much of it and I can literally grab them all right now. So I'm going to try to do the Manga in order first. I'll be back. This thing's about to fall. I'm scared. <laughs> I got my little stack of manga here. Let's get into it. It's not a lot. It's like five mangas. Not a lot. Like I said, this is mainly a Danmei haul. But I did buy some mangas. And I believe too, I bought like one book or something in here. We'll go over that. Maybe I'll put it after this clip. But I gotta find it. But <laughs> yeah, let's get into this little manga portion. The first one I got was Sasuke and Miano. Um, volume 2. I saw Kanuya, they were giving away keychain wall supplies last if you buy, you know, from the series. And I love this cover so much. It's so pretty compared to volume 1. So pretty and vibrant. But anyways, yes, I was like, oh my god, if they have it, I might as well, like, you know, buy it and continue the series as well. And I bought it at Kanuya. And so when I went to go check out, they didn't have any left, which I figured because Austin is so big here. In Texas where I live in this area so I'm pretty sure they have barely had it when I got in it it was like on a Saturday so of course pretty sure everyone bought it before me and it sold out really fast which sucks because you know I know live in that area it's like 30 minutes or 35 minutes from me depending on traffic and then from work it's like a bit further it's like 45 to 50 depending on traffic as well because like oh my god Austin's just so big but yeah I got this one. I can't wait to continue this wholesome BL manga series. It's like a slice of life as well too. Figuring out sexuality. Obviously too. Um, men and men romance. I can't wait. It's very wholesome. Nothing sexualized or anything. Um, at least so far because I only read volume 1. I'm going to read volume 2 eventually soon. But yeah, it's even wrapped up. Like Kanuya always wraps up their stuff. And it's just so cute. I love the colors. I need to buy a new chair. You guys can like probably hear my chair creaking. Next up. Continuing the series, I already finished the first season, technically, of Blue Lock. I got volume four. This one's a bit thicker, I feel like, than the other ones. But, yes, volume four. I'm sad as well because I already know what happens to this character later on. But, oh my god, this color is just so pretty. I don't think it's going to pick it up. Oh, it picked it up perfect. It's like this vibrant orange. I love the neon colors and the expressions. Because I freaking love soccer, if y'all don't know. Soccer is the only sport I understand and, like... I grew up with my brothers playing soccer, so I already know everything and such, and I always experience their soccer games. So, yeah, continuing the manga series because I love collecting it so far. Um, I cannot wait. Oh, can't wait to see it in manga form. I got this at Kanuya as well. I believe the same day as this at the BL ma uh, manga. Next up, I got this one at Barnes. Yes, at Barnes. The Pocket Theory Diaries um, Volume 8. I saw it, and I was like, give me this now and so i snatched it i freaking love my mouth i cannot wait to continue reading it because i only read volume one and two i need to continue the rest of the series and like binge it i really freaking do i'm almost done collecting the whole manga series for her i cannot wait and i know too there's like something going on right now as well but they're still gonna continue the manga the anime as well too so yes i freaking love the art style of this cover oh it's so pretty and continuing on with the Pocket Theory Diaries, I went ahead and got volume 9 at Kino Kanuya. Yeah, look at her. She looks so cute. I like this cover too. The covers never miss. I feel like with the Pocket Theory Diaries, they're always a hit for me. I can't wait to, could, like I mentioned, continue reading Mama. Sorry. <laughs> Next up, this is a pre order. I've been waiting for so long so I could continue reading the series. And now that I know that Dallas is stock up on this manga, I should have bought more of it, but you know what? I'll probably go on the weekend or something or like go to Houston and see if they have it because Dallas has such a good variety of manga of like ones I like. Like this manga specifically, pre-order from Barnes. Let's open it. You don't know how long it took me to get this freaking thing. I saw it at Kanuya that same day as I got the um, Apocalypse Diaries and I was like, that's coming in tomorrow. I already pre-ordered it. I shouldn't cancel it. Waited a whole nother week to get this baby. Oh! 
and I couldn't cancel it because it was already shipped. So it's like they kept delaying it. And I, I don't know, Barnes, why you do this to me? At least I got points for it, those stamps. So that's all that matters. <laughs> there it is. Oh my God, it's coming so much. Case one nine. It's been out of stock for so long. Hold on, let me give you a better view. It's been out of stock for a while, even on Amazon. And so they finally reprinted them, more of them. Like at least in Dallas, there's like a ton of it. But yeah, I freaking got Kamisama Kiss Volume 9 and been waiting for it. Surprisingly, oh no, don't tell me she's damaged. Oh, she's not damaged. She just looks kind of weird on the in the corners. But okay, I'm not mad. At least it's in really, really good condition. My only complaint is probably like this little scruff mark on the bottom that Barnes probably did here. But, oh, well, I've been waiting to read it so I can continue comments on my case. I'm probably going to reread it again to, so I can read volume 8, 9, and um, get volume 10 and 11. <laughs> because I freaking love Tomo and I freaking love Nanami. I freaking love their stories. So good. Like, dang, dang. <laughs> I'm a freaking simp. Um, yeah, I can't wait to continue this series. I always love to the art style. I can't wait to watch the anime. I really want to finish the manga first like actually for once with a manga series I've been reading and then watch the anime because like I feel like it's gonna be a whole different experience I've never done that before so usually I watch that like anime first before I read the manga but I want to do it differently this time with Kamisama Kiss because I just adore it so so much I even have a Nundoroi pre-ordered of Tomo coming in eventually next year mm, that's how you know I'm in this fandom I even have a t-shirt of them when I saw that Hot Topic a while back it's crazy Anyways, um, let me find that one book and a manhua I have, actually. Aha, uh -huh. they're in this Target bag. Target was doing a buy to get one free, but when I went, I guess because it was the last day or whatever, they didn't count my purchase, and I didn't know until I got in my car. I was like, you know what? I don't even care. It's fine. I paid it. I don't care. <laughs> so, the book I got that I can't wait to read because I already read this book's, um, uh, or this author's work this month in July. Um, it's on my shelf over there. But ee, this author, um, I can't say her name, Farida Abiyik, I believe is how you pronounce her name. But yeah, um, this author and this co-author that wrote it with them as well too. It's a duo collab book. It's um, Four Eads and a Funeral, I believe is how you pronounce it. I can't wait to read it. I know Zaylee had gone arc of it and Zaylee has a lot of copies of it. Zaylee loves it. I can't wait to read it myself eventually. I don't know when. Hopefully this year because I really love this author's works. I read Ace of Spades of them where Sleeping Girls Lie this month and I gave it five stars. So far every book has not missed for me and I'm so excited to read this one. But yeah, I bought this at Target because I thought, like I said, I would get one of them free but it's fine. I gotta take off the Target sticker now too when I'm done with this video because I don't like having stickers on my books. I learned from last time of keeping them on for like a year later or two when I finally get to them and it like ruined the freaking cover. So I need to start doing that. Y'all should start doing that too if you haven't. <laughs> so it doesn't get damaged. But yes, look at it. It's so pretty. I love the colors. So this is the America version. I know there's a UK edition. There's a paperback version as well too and the ARC version. But yeah, I got this, you know, edition. And then a manhua I got as well from Target that day. True Beauty, I'm finally gonna start it. I can't watch the drama because it's not on Netflix no more. I have to watch it on Viki. I need to get a Viki account eventually. I don't know when, <laughs> I really don't because I've been watching K-dramas this year. Let me check off the sticker while I talk. Um, keeping myself accountable. Because of Emily and the two, I have watched some K-dramas last year. It's just towards the end of the year I got into it. And of course to TikTok. But yeah, I want to watch True Beauty because I heard really good things. It's messed up in the back. Look at it. It's been like razor cuts. I don't know if you guys can see it that well here. Oh, that's going to bother me. But it's fine. It's beautiful. I can't wait to read it because as well too it was a webtoon um got turned to a drama and now it's a um manhwa so ee, can't wait because i have already the second one so i can like binge one and two and i know too they're doing it as well with my other favorite k drama my first like one i would count i've watched it so many times that's on netflix um business proposal freaking love that k drama so i can't wait to eventually read this one slash watch this drama as well but yeah that's it for those sections Let's get on to the Don May, which I'm sure a lot of y'all 
are waiting for. Let me do them in order as well. <sighs> There's some extras here. I gotta move them to the side until I get to that part. Okay, the first Donmei I bought this month. Oh, yes. <laughs> I don't know where I bought it from, to be honest. Did I buy it at Half Price Books? Oh, I did buy it at Half Price Books. Wait, I forgot to do the bingo thing for the summer challenge. Anyways, yes, I bought this these two at Half Price Books. The first one was Grandmaster Demonic Cultivation, aka MDCS Mado Sushi. This is the comic. This is the second one. I have the first one already. Oh, wait, no, sorry. This is the third one. <laughs> Look at it with the gold foiling. Mawenji Wei Wishin. And two. No spoilers, but it is colored. Can't wait to start this one eventually. But at least I have it. And the second one I bought two at Half Price Books is Scum Villain. I bought these both for $9.99. Both of them. Both of them. These are usually 20 bucks, y'all. $19.99 US dollars. I bought it for $9.99. Crazy to me. But yes, I got Scum Villain Volume 2. <laughs> the cover is so pretty. I cannot wait to read this one as well from MXTX. They're also by the same author of MDCS Scum Villain SVSSS. Can I wait to eventually read this one? <laughs> Your girl likes to buy ahead of time for myself because I know I've been getting into Donmei hardcore. Like, I'm in a slump where I just want to read Donmei. It's crazy. Um, <laughs> so there's that. Next up, I believe I got these. Buy one, get one 50% off at Barnes because I took off the sticker already, I believe. I don't have the receipt, but I know I did because I sent it in the Discord server that Frankie has. So I bought MTZS Grandmaster Demotic Cultivation, the comic volume 2. The second one, Away with Shin, Lawanji. So pretty, of course. So yes, I now have one, two, and three. <laughs> but I won't get one 50% off. I got it for like a fair price for these ones. Um, still continuing. I also got TGCF, aka um, Heaven Officials Blessing, volume five. This cover is just so freaking pretty. I think this is like one of my favorite co covers. It's just so stunning to me. So yeah, I also got this one for the half off at Barnes as well as another TGCF <laughs> volume six that I'm so not ready to read and cry but as well too I'm ready to cry <laughs> it's a thing anyways yes this cover is heart aching you can already tell I'm scared <laughs> and then continuing still with the buy one get one 50% off at um Barnes volume seven at TGCF heaven officials blessing I also adore this cover too I don't know if this one as well is my favorite cover it's hard to pick but She's so cute. If you know, you know uh, why Shillian is teaching Hua. And then the last one from... Wait, no. That was it. I'd buy one game 50% off. This one I bought at Barnes um, literally a few days after. The special edition of Thousand Autumns, which is the last one, volume 5. It came as well too with extras because it's a special edition. It comes with some stickers, which are really cute. I can't wait to meet these characters. A bookmark. I don't know if it's going to focus, but yes, a bookmark, which is really, really pretty in my opinion. A poster, which is really nice quality printed as well too. And as well too, postcards from each of the covers of the Danmei, which is really cute. <laughs> They're just so stunning. And as well too, they have little graphics on the back of them doing them so in order so this one's like kind of like a i guess a wolf and a deer one like a little chibi um animal that represents them which is really cute <laughs> these are just so pretty i love Dami so much that it comes with a bunch of goodies for us like regular books keep up and then this a beautiful poster as well two of them <laughs> Dame is crazy. But yeah, as well too, there's some pictures in here. I'm not going to try to spoil it. But yeah, this is the last one, A Thousand Autumns. I went ahead and bought it. Like I said, full price though at Barnes. Special edition. Came with those goodies. Ooh. Can't wait to eventually get into A Thousand Autumns. Um, next up is Target. Like I said, the buy one, get one thing, but it didn't actually happen. I got Grandmaster of Demoto Cultivation, the last one, aka MDCS, the special edition. Oh man, this is a chonker. Oh, there's some special stuff inside the flap. I'm gonna open first. Oh my god! Stop! Okay, the bookmark. It's me, Lawan G, and my hubby, Wei Wishin. <laughs> and then here's the postcards. I think this is volume two. And then the little bunny. This is volume one of the postcard. So pretty. And then the back. Oh my god, it's so cute. I think this is. This one's three, volume three, I believe. That's scary to me, and the little bunnies. 
And then this is, I believe, four. I don't know because I don't have like <laughs> three and four. And now I have volume five. Here's volume five. So cute. And look at the stickers. Look at Lava G. Oh my god, we wish Shannon. Oh my god, this is so cute. I'm scared for the poster, y'all. I have not opened it. I'm shaking. <laughs> Oh my god, I want to, oh my god, look at the artwork. This is, I think, my favorite poster. It's so pretty. Oh, look at that one, Jane Wibishan. Can I wait to move out eventually and, like, have them frame up? <laughs> because that's so freaking pretty. These are so pretty. Look at it. Oh my god. They're so pretty. Stop. Okay, and then... Here is the book. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, I figured that might happen. We'll take off the stuff later. I am a menace. Here is the little notebook of it. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh my god, you can see Wei Wei Shen in there on the moon. And then look at Lao Wang Ji. It's me. That's <laughs> so cute. Oh my god, and then the back, it's Lao Wang Ji and then Wei Wei Shen. <gasps> Wei Wei Shen, Lao Wang Ji at the moon. Oh my god. That's so freaking cute. My battery's about to die. I have to switch it out. No. Okay, so sorry if the angle's um, off. Change the battery. But anyways, that's MDCS. Um, the last one. I just need three and four. And then I'm done with M MDCS collecting the regular Donmei. Um, anyways, let's continue. Next up, another Barnes one. A big Barnes bag. This one also. Um, buy one, get one 50% off. Anyways, let's do that real quick. Oh, yes, um, Meat Bun, I believe is pronounced this author's one. Case File of Conception. Oh, I cannot wait to read this one, the cover. Oh, cannot wait. It looks so good. I think this one's like more of a like mystery type of Don May one. Oh, ooh, ooh, can't wait to read this one. And then, <laughs> I don't know why these ones don't have the sticker on them. I gotta take them off. Um, Continuing the case file one, I went ahead and got the second one. <laughs> yes, I went ahead and get the second one because they had it out. It came out recently when I saw it at the table. And they had it there, I guess because overstock. So I got the second one. This cover's so pretty and like heartaching. I'm scared to read it. And now let me take off the buy one get one fifty percent off. Look at the freaking spines together of the case file of both of them. So freaking pretty, in my opinion at least. I love Tanmei. Next up, <laughs> I believe now I completed it because I have Thousand Autumns 1, I got 5, I got 2, and 4, so I need 3 is the last one I need of Thousand Autumns. I went ahead and got them because Thousand Autumns Volume 3 wasn't on the table, sadly, of the buy one get on 50% off, but hey. Your girl got most of the series done too, collected. These are so pretty. Like I said, I love buying sales when I see Donmei because you never know when you're going to see them again because like I said before, they are not cheap, um, which makes sense. You know, translated work into the artwork, I feel like, as well. So that's why they're like $20. So whenever I see there's a freaking sale on any Donmei of the comics, anything, or like a Target too even, I will buy it. I am so sorry. Your girl's just trying to save money for my future self. And not go through the headache because I am as well too a collector, so it's kind of bad. I think now with these Donmeys, that whole shelf I have on my shelf is gonna be filled with Donmei, and then I think the next shelf I'm gonna have to like rearrange it and make it another Donmei section. Crazy to me, <laughs> but anyways, next up, I bought this one at Kanuya actually, Scum Villain, the first one. So now I have one and two. I'm gonna buddy read as well with Chloe. I bought a Kanuya, I saw it there. Um, because it's been sold out for a while at Kanuya. I don't know why. But when I had it in stock when I was looking with my boyfriend, I was like, I'm gonna grab it. So I grabbed it. <laughs> so I paid full price for this one as well. I gotta take off the sticker for Kanuya. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna have to come back to that. <laughs> this one, for some odd reason, by MXCX is really thin. Scum villain. I don't know why. Next up, this one is from Minneapolis. Oh my god, it is is okay what a slay moment oh let me take this out i bought it from peach flower house <laughs> it's another don my company that isn't seven c's look at it <laughs> oh my god it's oh my god it's in really amazing condition 
Thank God it's not damaged. It's been sold out for so long. So when I was following Peach Flower um, House, they said in July they were going to restock Little Mushroom and I bought it. I was like, you know what? Let me buy it right now. So I paid full price for this plus shipping. So it was like $24. Um, it's fine. But yeah, it's Little Mushroom. Um, can I wait to read this one? Like, look at it. It's so pretty. And then look at the spine. It's so different from Seven Seas. And like, oh my god. Oh, It's just so freaking pretty. I can't wait to read this one. I need to get the second one as well. It's in the year 2020. <laughs> it's set in this world. I like that. Okay. Um, that's all I'm going to say about that one. I cannot wait to read it. The formatting is different too from like, oh my gosh, she's thick. I didn't realize that. Oh, she feels way different. I don't know if it has like pictures either question mark i don't think it does no it doesn't have any photos sadly but you know what i'm so excited because one of my dame friends as well highly on their dame um ranking so and then stitch really loves little mushrooms so i'm like y'all got me so next up last but not least a pre-order that came in yesterday i don't remember but i've had it for a little bit now um got it from amazon <laughs> It's Peerless! It's a new Donmei series by Seven Seas. I cannot wait to eventually read this one. A Murder and Void, A Stolen Treasure. <gasps> Ooh, okay. As well, too, it's the same author of From A Thousand Autumns, and it's set in the same world. You got me sold. So I gotta read A Thousand Autumns first, I feel like, and then eventually read Peerless. Which is funny because Thousand Autumns literally finished this month, and then the author released this one this month, too, towards the end, which is funny to me. I cannot wait. Oh, oh, we have a monk. Uh, Guyon. <laughs> I'm like looking through the photos real quick because I'm going to forget later on anyways. I, I love the bordering on like these chapters. Like, wow. But yeah, anyways, I cannot wait to read this one. Look at the spine on Peerless. Wow, that is so freaking pretty. I cannot wait to like see the spines together with the, the rest of the series coming out eventually. But yeah, that is it for my manga haul, my book haul, slash Danme mainly haul. I hope you all enjoyed it. I spent so much money on these. <laughs> kind of crazy. I'm going to slow down next month in August. So at least I'm hoping to. Probably when this goes out, it's going to be in August. So I hope you all are having a good month so far. <laughs> Future tense. But yeah, I hope you all have a good day. Good night, morning. Whatever time it is for you, when the data reaches you. And until next time, I will see you hopefully very soon. Bye.